Hey, what's going on everybody? This is Tyrone back with Tech Life. And in today's video, I wanted to do some more speed testing on Verizon's unlimited plan. I already went over the 22 gigabyte threshold. I'm now at 41, 47. I don't know why, but the screen recording app that I'm using blocks out anything that I try to show from the photo app drawer. As soon as I go in it, the screen just goes blank. So I will post that screenshot in another video showing that I've used 41.47 gigabytes and that I have six days left in the cycle. So here we go. All right, so far it's been a pleasant experience not having to worry about if I'm gonna go over my gigabytes, am I gonna get throttled down? So that's really good. You know, when I miss some of my shows, I like to watch the arrow and the flash at work I could just pop it up on the lunch break watch an episode and not have to worry about anything so that's really good I have not yet in my other testing that I've done so far I have not yet experienced any slowdown except a little bit but it it didn't take long for it to go back to normal speeds so in this area speeds are normal so definitely good to see that it is about 10 18 p.m. at night some people are still up. Some people have already gone to bed. Righty. Yeah, so speeds are definitely normal for this area that I'm in now. Also in the comment section down below let me know if you're on Verizon and how you are enjoying the unlimited plan also I am looking into uh, figuring out how to separate the, the hotspot from the unlimited data um, it is separated so the 22 gigabyte threshold is not included in the uh, 10 gigabytes so that is completely separate but I will definitely figure out uh, how to separate that. I will call Verizon tomorrow to see if there's anything that tracks that separately. Currently there isn't from what I've seen on the app. So I will definitely get on that tomorrow. All right, so it looks like there's a little slowdown here in this area that I'm in now. I'm currently uh, driving. So definitely, this is not normal for this area. Usually it's around 15 to 20. So as you can see, the download is at 1.29 megabits and the, up, and the upload is higher. So that means congestion. As you can see, when the upload is higher than the download, that means congestion. That means there are more people downloading than uploading. That means the network is congested. Mm -hmm. Alright, so it's picking up a little bit. Still usable though. Still usable speeds. Can't download nothing crazy on those speeds, but it'll still allow you to multitask and do anything else that you need to do on the phone. But just to clarify, these speeds are not normal for this area. So there's something that's pulling them down. Like some of you guys stated, it might not necessarily be the uh, deprioritization. It might just be network management or just a little bit more traffic than usual. But as you can see now, speeds are getting really slow. So this might be an indication for deprioritization because this is not normal for this area whatsoever. So I'm glad this is happening live so you can see this. And we'll see how long this, this lasts in this area. And 
it's already picking up. I'm still in the same area that I just got below one megabit and now I'm up to, let's see what it finishes at, up to eight, 8.78. 8. See, and that only took, what, 40 seconds maybe? And I'm still in, that, in the same area that I was in when, when the speeds were below one megabit. Now upload seems to be struggling. Could be that I just hit a period currently where a lot of people in this area are uploading Snapchats and Instagram videos. Yep, and now I'm slow again. Yeah, I'm so glad this is happening live so you guys can actually see this. And boom. As you can see, it lasted maybe 20 seconds. You wouldn't have never noticed that in a real world experience. You wouldn't have never noticed it. Only if you're running speed tests will you notice deprioritization, and it usually doesn't last that long. So, definitely glad that this is happening live, so you guys can actually see how it works. Alrighty, so, definitely a lot of T-Mobile advertisement going on there. <laughs> Alrighty, so, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I will definitely be back more with more content tomorrow. The giveaway ends tomorrow. The winner will be announced later on uh, Friday evening. So definitely stay tuned for that. Like, share, subscribe. Give these videos a thumbs up. I'm glad that this happened live so you guys were able to see it happen live. And um, this is Tyrone with Tech Life. And I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.